M0FXB just regarding the RSBA1 software. So I've done one video for access mode settings, but the mode that actually worked for me better was station mode. So I'm going to show you how you do it. So it did just now have a little square there saying WLAN, and that's when you know it's working. But I've just gone out of range so, so I can make this video of the, of the router. But anyway, so what you do, I'll just show you the settings. Just go menu, set, wireless LAN, remote settings, um, network user number one on network user ID, put in IC705 there, same as that tap that create yourself a password and network user administration select yes let's just go back okay so network control valid after restart on and then these are all default so power the 5001 which is the main one um, 5002 three just showed you these ones let's go back so the connection type so you can choose two now this video is about station so um, imagine that if you use access you're basically setting up this radio the 705 as a server now i couldn't get that to work to be honest so i thought i'll show you the one i could get to work which is this one where you use the radio as a station and it and somehow it also connects to your router at home so when I select it, these are the settings I used. <clears throat> so obviously the wireless line is on, connection type station that you've chosen, and then you have your station settings. Um, and then what I did was just clicked, um, I think I clicked access point, waited a while, and it just found it on its own, the, you know, my router, which already had the password. So obviously if you haven't put the passwords in, you need to get your, the, your router password in. These are the different ones in my house. So once I did that, this IP address appeared, which is 192.168.1.104. And that is the IP address that I used when I went into the settings of the RSBA1 configuration, which then connected it to my, uh, to my router. So I'm guessing that if I had um, the, my public IP, somehow I would know, I would, if I wanted to remotely connect from outside this house, I would um, somehow use my public IP to get to my router and then get to the radio. Now, I haven't done that, but this is just me sat using the radio on a laptop wirelessly um, with the radio sat next to the laptop and the router within, you know, within range, my home broadband router. So hope this helps. It worked for me and uh, got me up and running. 7-3, all the best.